beginning of Jesus Christ, but in astronomy, that day is also the two-year anniversary of the launching of NASA's James Webb Space Telescope, humanity's finest observatory of all time. Released on Christmas Day 2021, James Webb has been our cosmic workhorse, revealing the universe in an entirely new light with unprecedented resolution and wavelength coverage. Since its birthday, James Webb has left astronomers feeling festive, recently allowing them to picture a colorful cluster of galaxies they have dubbed the Christmas Tree Galaxy Cluster. In this cluster, the James Webb Space Telescope found flickering Christmas lights in the form of 14 new transient celestial objects that brighten dramatically before dimming. Officially known as Max J0416, located approximately 4.3 billion light years from Earth, this winter wonderland was noticed by teaming up the James Webb Space Telescope with the Hubble Space Telescope. The sheer number of transients observed in a single pass, thanks to the duo, implies there are many more yet to be discovered within the Christmas Tree Galaxy Cluster. It's almost like a Christmas gift for astronomers that'll keep on giving. The light from the Christmas Tree Galaxy Cluster began its journey through the cosmos when the solar system, now 4.6 billion years old, was newly formed and just around 300 million years old. This would mostly make it too faint for even the Webb Telescope to see in detail, but a little trick first noted by Albert Einstein in his 1915 theory of general relativity made looking at this cosmic Christmas a little easier. Einstein said objects of great mass could warp the very fabric of space and time, giving rise to a curvature we experience as gravity. When an object passes between Earth and a light source, the light takes varied paths, causing it to appear amplified from our vantage point. This phenomenon, known as gravitational lensing, has been tapped into with great success by James Webb to see some of the universe's earliest glimmers. Its view of the Christmas tree galaxy cluster is its latest example. The transients were observed by Yen and the team as they were examining four sets of images captured by James Webb over around four months as part of the James Webb Space Telescope's PAIRS G176 program. The team has identified objects in the images as supernova explosions, thrilled by this result as they now use these supernovas to study the galaxies where they're occurring. Furthermore, the astronomers also discovered something else splendid inside the Christmas Tree Galaxy Cluster, a monster star in a galaxy seen as it was when the universe was just 3 billion years old. They have named the star, Mothra, after the giant moth kaiju from Japanese cinema. The galaxy where Mothra lurks was lensed to around 40,000 times its original brightness. The object lensing this galaxy is currently unknown, but Yen and the team estimate it has a mass of between 10,000 and 1 million times that of the Sun. As Jose Diego, the study's lead author and a scientist at the Institute of Astrophysics of the Canaries, said, this is a totally new view of the universe that's been opened by James Webb's photo in space. Only a few weeks ago, a picture of Copia A, the remains of a star that exploded 340 years ago, was also unveiled by First Lady Jill Biden as part of a new White House advent calendar. These images and others follow a long tradition of astronomers and stargazers connecting the season of light with cosmic phenomena occurring light years from Earth. But there is true scientific wonder involved in some of these festive observations. Unlike the Christmas tree galaxy cluster, Copia A is much closer to home. Scientists have long studied this violent explosion and others like it to figure out their role in cosmic evolution. They help galaxies grow. Danny Milovich, an astrophysicist at Purdue University who studies Copia A, wrote in an email, Supernova remnants also create the elements needed to sustain life, like the oxygen we breathe, the iron in our blood, and the calcium in our bones. At 110,000 light years from Earth, Copia A has been studied by a range of space telescopes in visible, X-ray, and infrared wavelengths. However, Webb's new infrared image provides a clearer view. In April, NASA released an image of the supernova remnant using the telescope's mid-infrared instrument. The latest image uses Webb's near-infrared camera, capturing gas, dust, and molecules radiating at higher temperatures. The red and orange structures enveloped in smoky material against a backdrop of glittering stars resemble an ornament hanging from a tree branch. As Dr. Milich said, two years ago, Webb launched perfectly on Christmas morning. At the time, I thought it was the best Christmas present ever, but the telescope is the gift that keeps giving. What's intriguing is James Webb isn't the only observatory sending us Christmas presents. 
A distant star forming nebula that looks like a turkey fleeing a cosmic Christmas dinner has just been captured in a new image by the European Southern Observatory's Very Large Telescope in Chile. The festive picture features the star hatching clouds of gas and dust that form the nebula IC 2944, located around 6,500 light years from Earth. IC 2944 has a distinctly F like appearance, leading astronomers to nickname it the Running Chicken Nebula. In the stunning new 1.5 billion pixel VLT image, the wispy tendrils of gas and dust glow in pink, red, and orange, punctuated by bright blue stars resembling lights on a Christmas tree. The running chicken nebula is about 71 light years wide and lies toward the constellation of Centaurus. It contains several SCP areas, all of which are highlighted in the new image, covering a patch of the sky as wide as 25 full moons. The brightest region, appearing as the back of this cosmic bird, is known as IC 2948. This area is rich with vibrant gas and dust plumage and punctuated with bright blue light from hot, young stars. These stars spread through the rest of the nebula as well, carving this cosmic chicken by emitting substantial amounts of ultraviolet radiation that disperses gas and dust, curtailing further star formation. However, some regions of the running chicken, called Bach globules, resist this high-energy radiation and appear as dark, dense pockets of gas and dust scattered around the nebula. Further up the celestial bird is a bright vertical pillar-like structure known as IC 2944, which resembles a bird wing in the process of flapping. At the top of IC 2944 is the twinkling star Lambda Centauri, closer to Earth than the running chicken nebula at just 470 light-years away. The star is so bright that it can be seen from Earth with the naked eye. In the upper right of the image, two emission nebulae, regions of extremely hot ionized gas known as GUM-39 and GUM-40, make up the head of the running chicken. Another emission nebula, GUM-41, can be seen to the lower right of the image, forming the foot of the cosmic bird. Completing the new image is a sprinkling of white and blue stars that resemble falling flakes of snow. Each one is as unique and intricate as a real snowflake. Elsewhere in space, to celebrate the festive season, the Hubble telescope has also gifted us a remarkable starry snow globe. The subject of the image is the billion star containing UGC 891, an irregular dwarf galaxy located in the constellation Pisces, some 7 million light years from Earth. To create the luminous chromatic effect we see, scientists assembled data captured by the Hubble Space Telescope's Wide Field Camera 3 a versatile survey camera, between 2006 and 2021. They processed the data through 12 filters that sampled both broad and narrow wavelengths covering mid-ultraviolet to visible red light. The red patches are thought to be interstellar hydrogen molecules, while the glints inside are older stars in the very background or other distant galaxies, so far away they almost appear as single stars. Clearly, we assume that seeing shapes in space telescope images, Christmas-related or otherwise, is akin to seeing shapes in clouds, it's all open to creative interpretation. But there's no denying that the images are stunning, no matter what they resemble. In short, even the cosmos is wishing you a happy holiday. Now, on the brink of the new year, let's take a quick look at the most stunning, jaw-dropping James Webb moments from 2023. One of the most distant black holes ever was unveiled last month while combining Chandra X-ray data with James Webb's deep infrared views of the galaxy cluster Abel 2744. Scientists revealed a tiny, distant early galaxy with only around 10 to 100 million solar masses worth of material in it. However, it was extraordinarily X-ray luminous, indicating an active black hole of around 9 million solar masses. Not only is this the most remote black hole ever found, but it's also our first example of such an extreme mass ratio, where the central black hole is roughly as big as all the stars in the host galaxy combined. Two new insights of the Crab Nebula, within the year 1054, a supernova went off in the Milky Way or galaxy, so brilliant and enduring, it was visible from Earth for an extended period. Now, almost 1000 years later, we can look in that same area of the sky and find the Crab Nebula, a supernova remnant more than 10 light years across, with a young, energetic, spinning neutron star at its core, the Crab Pulsar. While Hubble's visible light views highlight various aspects and knots of gas that reflect light. 
James Webb's infrared views reveal the presence of dust, expanded electrons, and even features carved out by the central pulsar's winds and magnetism. The question of the mass deficit or where all the supposedly missing material that would have been needed for the progenitor star to explode may yet find its answer in the still being analyzed Webb data. James Webb's private ever view, the James Webb Space Telescope Advanced Deep Extragalactic Survey JDS collaboration, has released a fully zoomable, explorable view of their field with various HN filters and MPC spectra that can be overlaid in a standard set of the object's image. Though this represents a relatively narrow field of view in the sky, it includes the most remote galaxy ever discovered to this point, as well as a slew of candidate objects that may yet prove to be even farther away. It showcases the incredible breadth and diversity of what is possible with James Webb. For a sneak peek into the Oort Nebula beneath James Webb's sharp eyes, there are a significant number of awe-inspiring new stars still in the process of forming. Some of them shown here are Herbig Haro objects, large young stars highlighted by stellar outflows. In other cases, there are protostars still in the process of formation, young single and binary stars that have already finished forming, and nebulous regions that even James Webb cannot penetrate. Lastly, there have been some surprises. Jupiter mass objects that are members of no stellar system, including a relatively large fraction of them that are binary objects. The images are as stunning as the science is profound. The most remote gravitational lens ever is at the center of this image, a massive compact galaxy located approximately 17 billion light years away. Within this expanding universe, the ring around it with red spots is actually a more distant galaxy that is located along the same line of sight as the closer galaxy, but gravity has distorted it into a ring, an example of gravitational lensing. While more distant background lenses have been observed, this represents the most remote foreground lens, the object actually doing the lensing, ever observed. In the realm of cosmic discoveries, James Webb continues to unveil breathtaking vistas of the universe, pushing the boundaries of our knowledge and reshaping our cosmic narrative. From the depths of space to the earliest moments of the cosmos, Webb's observations have provided unprecedented insights into the mysteries that pervade our universe. One of the most remarkable achievements of James Webb is its ability to peer into the distant reaches of space, capturing the light from galaxies that formed billions of years ago. By studying these ancient galaxies, astronomers can piece together the story of cosmic evolution, tracing the origins of stars, galaxies, and even the structure of the universe itself. In addition to its deep space observations, James Webb has also revolutionized our understanding of nearby celestial objects by examining objects within our own solar system, such as asteroids, comets, and planets. Webb has provided new insights into the processes that shape these bodies and the conditions that exist within our cosmic neighborhood. Furthermore, James Webb's advanced instruments have enabled astronomers to study the atmospheres of exoplanets, worlds orbiting distant stars beyond our solar system. By analyzing the composition and properties of these atmospheres, scientists hope to identify signs of habitability or even detect the presence of life on other planets. Beyond its scientific achievements, James Webb has captured the imagination of people around the world, inspiring awe and wonder at the vastness and beauty of the cosmos. Its stunning images and groundbreaking discoveries have captivated audiences of all ages, sparking curiosity and fostering a deeper appreciation for the wonders of the universe. Looking ahead, James Webb promises to continue pushing the limits of our knowledge, unlocking new mysteries, and revealing the hidden secrets of the cosmos. With its extraordinary capabilities and innovative technology, it stands poised to revolutionize our understanding of the universe and our place within it. As we celebrate the remarkable achievements of James Webb, we also look forward to the discoveries that lie ahead, knowing that each new observation brings us closer to unraveling the mysteries of the cosmos and understanding the true nature of our universe. In conclusion, the James Webb Space Telescope has transformed our understanding of the cosmos, revealing the universe in unprecedented detail and shedding light on some of its deepest mysteries from distant galaxies to nearby planets, from the earliest moments of cosmic history to the present. Webb's observations have reshaped our cosmic narrative and inspired wonder and curiosity in people around the world. As we continue to explore the cosmos with James Webb, we anticipate the discoveries that await us and the new insights that will shape our understanding of the universe for generations to come.
As we celebrate the extraordinary achievements of the James Webb Space Telescope JWST, it's important to highlight some of its most stunning and jaw-dropping moments from 2023. One of the standout discoveries was the detection of one of our most distant black holes ever. Combining Chandra X-ray data with JWST's deep infrared views of the galaxy cluster Abel 2744, scientists identified a tiny, distant early galaxy with only around 10 to 100 million solar masses worth of material. Despite its small size, this galaxy was incredibly X-ray luminous, indicating the presence of an active black hole with a mass of around 9 million solar masses. This discovery not only marks the most remote black hole ever found but also showcases an extreme mass ratio where the central black hole is nearly as large as all the stars in its host galaxy combined. Another significant insight from 2023 involved new observations of the Crab Nebula. Formed from a supernova explosion in the Milky Way in the year 1054, the Crab Nebula spans more than 10 light years across. JWST's infrared views complement Hubble's visible light views by revealing dust, expanded electrons, and features sculpted by the central pulsar's winds and magnetism. These observations are shedding light on the ongoing mystery of the Crab Nebula's mass deficit and the origin of its progenitor star. Additionally, JWST's Advanced Deep Extragalactic Survey JDS, collaboration released a fully zoomable and explorable view of their field. This view includes the most remote galaxy ever discovered to date and numerous candidate objects that may prove even farther away. It demonstrates the incredible range and capabilities of JWST in unraveling the mysteries of deep space. Turning to the Ore Nebula, JWST's sharp eyes have uncovered a wealth of new stars still in the process of forming. These include Herbig Haro objects, large young stars highlighted by stellar outflows, and protostars in various stages of formation. Some surprising finds include Jupiter mass objects that are not part of any stellar system, underscoring JWST's ability to reveal unexpected phenomena in the cosmos. In another groundbreaking discovery, JWST observed the most remote gravitational lens ever detected. This lensing effect, where gravity from a foreground galaxy bends and magnifies the light from a more distant galaxy, provides a unique window into the distant universe. Such discoveries push the boundaries of our understanding and offer unprecedented insights into cosmic evolution and structure. Overall, JWST continues to revolutionize our understanding of the universe, from its earliest moments to the present day. By capturing the light from ancient galaxies and studying nearby celestial objects in our solar system, JWST is paving the way for new discoveries and deeper insights into the cosmos. Its advanced instruments and innovative technology promise to uncover more secrets of the universe and inspire future generations to explore the wonders of space. As we reflect on JWST's achievements and look forward to its future discoveries, we are reminded of the profound impact this telescope has had on our cosmic perspective. Each observation brings us closer to understanding the fundamental questions about our universe's origins, evolution, and ultimate fate. JWST stands as a testament to human ingenuity and our enduring quest to unravel the mysteries of the cosmos.